What's up, Vex fam? Razor here, and today I have something I am really excited about. I have a product review of two of the new peripherals from Turtle Beach. So before we get into that, as you guys all know, Turtle Beach has some excellent sound equipment. They've had an ongoing record and have been partnered with MLG for years now. Um, Turtle Beach has been proven to have great headsets and great audio all around. They are now expanding. They are offering new peripherals and expanding into the gaming universe. And now they offer mice and keyboards. And today, we are going to review both a Turtle Beach mouse and a Turtle Beach keyboard. But before we get into what I have, let's talk about what Turtle Beach has to offer now. So, when you're talking about keyboards, Turtle Beach has three keyboards to offer. The Impact 100 the Impact 500, and the Impact 700. Each is a higher step up, um, and each has its own benefit. So the Impact 100 is like a basic gaming keyboard, the Impact 500 is a mechanical gaming keyboard, and then the Impact 700 is a the, the, you know, the larger scope mechanical keyboard. Um, on the flip side of that, they also offer two different mice configurations. The Grip 300, which is an optical gaming mouse, and then the Grip 500, which is a laser gaming mouse. Um, so they are expanding on what they have to offer as far as peripherals, but these are what they have on their plate right now. And today we are going to talk about the Grip 500 laser mouse and the Impact 500 mechanical keyboard. So I got these things about 24 hours ago, and I wanted to make sure that I put them to the test before I did a review. So I have made sure that I put the hours in on various games on PC from Rocket League to Unreal Tournament to Counter-Strike um, and putting in the time and comparing it to what I've had in the previous. Now for those of you that know me, I am a PC gamer. Um, I love gaming in general. I've been playing a lot of Gears of War recently and obviously a lot of Call of Duty, but I play a lot of PC games too and PC games are where I came from in the originally. Unreal Tournament was where I kind of got my start in, in playing games on the PC. So, that being said, I've had a lot of different mice and a lot of different keyboards over the years. So I wanted to make sure that I did a, a good comparison and, and, and talk about what I like about them. So, let's get right into the keyboard. This keyboard, the Impact 500, is phenomenal. Not only is it small and doesn't take up a lot of space on your, on your desk, but it is one of the sturdiest keyboards that I've ever seen. Um, and the keys feel so nice. They absolutely feel great. They're covered with like this kind of plastic material. It's like this plastic coating that just makes your fingers feel so good on the actual keyboard. And again, because it doesn't have a number key on the side, it is a really small profile keyboard. I'd say it's maybe four maybe 16 inches long um, so it's it's really great and we're gonna go ahead and cut to a little video and talk a little bit about more of the keyboard and let you see it in depth and there it is guys the turtle beach impact 500 um, as you can see it's a very low profile keyboard which means that it's very small it has no number keys on the side of it it is all mechanical with Cherry Blue MX switches, which are some of the best switches in my opinion. Um, it's got six key rollover with full anti-ghosting. Um, it's steel reinforced chassis. This thing is actually really, really solid and it's very heavy. Um, very, very well made keyboard. USB plug in the back, mini micro USB, so you can actually detach the cable and and travel with this thing and it's like I said really small so you can plop it in a backpack and be on the go. It is a tournament grade um, keyboard which is very very nice and as you can see and here for yourself the keys have a very nice click to them, very very nice pressure behind them. Um, really 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 stable sturdy keyboard. Alright guys, so there you have it. This is the box. The Impact 500 Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. It is $129 on the Turtle Beach website. And then obviously you can use the code VEXFAM1. Save yourself 10%. I highly recommend it. It's 
probably one of the best keyboards that I've ever had, and I'm not being biased here. I'm I'm being honest with everybody. It's steel reinforced, so the thing is really durable. It's gonna take you know traveling, and that's what this keyboard is designed for. Is you know to be able to go out to tournaments and be able to bring your keyboard. So that's why it has the removable plug and play USB on the back of it. Um, it's a very very durable keyboard, and like I said, the keys are so nice. Listen to this. Mm, it's like music music so impact 500 big big thumbs up turtle beach you guys hit this nail on the head the cherry blue mx switches are the exact what i like on my keyboard so i was really happy that this offered those um some of the best mechanical switches out there and uh turtle beach definitely hit the nail on the head with their with their first line of keyboards absolutely so now we're going to go into the mouse and this mouse is actually incredible now I've always been really partial to the razor death adder because I like high back mice and I don't need a lot going on on my mouse I've seen things like the rat 7 and they just has so much going on it I, I don't need all that I need a few buttons on the side and I need functionality and that's what the grip 500 delivers is it delivers functionality with simplicity um, it's just got the basic three buttons on the side it has a nice rubber coating on the actual mouse itself to make your hand kind of grip to it without being sticky. We're going to cut to a video so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Check it out. Guys, and here is the Turtle Beach Grip 500. This is their laser mouse, gaming mouse. And uh, this actually is made from some of the highest quality components out there. It's got the Avergo 9800 laser sensor and the Omicron switches. So it's going to have some of the highest response out there for a mouse. Um, it's also got a lot of customization options as we'll go into here. You can see on the side, it's got three buttons there that you can program. It's got the DPI switch here, your two clicks. Um, and obviously, you can micro or macro these to anything that you want. So you can program these buttons to any keyboard function or anything else, a combination of functions. Um, you can flip this side to side and make that a function as well. Um, you can change the colors um, within the software and customize it to how you want it to look. And another really great option with this mouse is, is that on the bottom here, this little button, you have five different profiles that you can switch from. So you can have a different profile set up for each game depending on the sensitivity and the button configuration that you would like for that game and you can switch through those on the fly. Another really, really nice feature about this mouse is it is rubber coated. You kind of see when I rub my finger like that. It's got this nice rubber coating film on it that really, really, really makes your hand feel comfortable and stick to it without being sticky. Um, and it is a high back mouse, as you can see here. Um, and I really, really like high back mice. It just makes so that your hand kind of lays on top of the mouse and is completely comfortable. And obviously it's very ergonomic to where the buttons are very easily pressed on the side. Um, very, very, very nice mouse. Boom. All right, guys, there's the box for the Grip 500. Definitely one of the best laser mice out there. Um, it's got some of the greatest technology with the Omicron, and, uh, you know, it's definitely a well-built mouse. And especially for only $69, I, I, I've spent more than that on previous mice that I didn't like as much as I like this one. Um, really, really impressed with Turtle Beach and... and the time that they took to be able to come out with peripherals, um, you know, because they've done headsets for a long time. We've always wondered, are they going to expand into gaming a little bit more? Um, and just recently, they've, they've delivered these, you know, these new things, the keyboards and the mice. And uh, I definitely think that once they get out there more and people see and know that Turtle Beach is making these, that um, these are going to be favorites for a lot of people. I definitely recommend checking these out, especially if you're a Counter-Strike fan because I love Counter-Strike, and I know that high-back mice are a real big benefit to people that play Counter-Strike because of the way your hand rests, um, and it just creates a better um, environment for muscle memory to be maintained when you're playing like that. Um, 
such a great mouse. I'm, I'm, I'm super impressed with it. Um, I've been a Razer fanboy for a long time, and Turtle Beach has taken me away. They, they really have. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this product review. If you have any questions or comments, make sure to hit them below, and make sure you hit that subscribe button, guys. We will see you next time.